To get a paper airplane to fly forever, we will need to do what the Wright brothers did. Make an airplane which stays flying and can be steered. We'll do it in your living room with just a piece of paper, a sheet of cardboard, and you as the pilot. To build the paper airplane, we first cut out a strip of paper of dimensions one and three quarters inches by five and a half inches. The paper should be very light newsprint, such as phone book paper. We then fold about a quarter of an inch of the long edge up. Then you fold the opposite long edge in the opposite direction, so one goes up and one goes down. Then you flatten out the long edge folds at the short edge and fold the short edge up about three quarters of an inch. And do the same for the opposite short edge. Okay, to fold the glider, take one of the rear edges, fold it up just a little bit, and then fold it all the way across from one end to the other. Then turn it over and do the opposite edge in the opposite direction. So one goes up and one goes down. Next, to do the half end fold, the uh, short ends, uh, flatten out these folds here and then fold it up a little bit more to about a uh, quarter of an inch. And the same with the other one, the other side. And that's your tumble wing glider. Before launching the paper airplane, stop anything which might cause wind, such as open windows or doors, fans or vents. To launch the paper airplane, hold it straight up and down with the top long edge fold pointing away from you. Pull back gently as you let go of the paper airplane to start the backwards rotation. Here's the flying paper airplane under a strobe light showing the rotation motion as the paper airplane flies. Okay, to launch your glider, make sure the glider is straight up and down like this. Make sure that the top fold is facing away from you. And just hold it by that top fold and let it go. Away we go. To keep the paper airplane flying, we'll need to move the cardboard sheet just right. So we'll first get the paper airplane flying, then approach with the cardboard sheet going a little faster than the paper airplane flies. So launch the paper airplane high and forward of the cardboard. Launch the paper airplane high and forward of the cardboard sheet. Then move the cardboard smoothly forward to meet and then keep the paper airplane flying. Now that we're flying, how do we steer the paper airplane so we can fly around that tree? To steer the paper airplane in flight, angle the cardboard in the direction you want to steer. Angle the cardboard to the left to steer to the left and to the right to the steer to the right. An airplane that can be steered was probably the Wright brothers' greatest contribution. Wilbur Wright said, If you are looking for perfect safety, you will do well to sit on a fence and watch the birds. But, if you really wish to learn, you must mount a machine and become acquainted with its tricks by actual trial. Wilbur Wright Getting a paper airplane to fly forever does not require you to mount a machine, but you must get off the fence. Now you know what you need to keep the paper airplane flying under your control. May you fly friendly skies.